Okay, so um, we're going to get into uh, kind of my outlook and approach on hybrid picking, uh, which means um, playing with the pick in your thumb and first finger uh, and then using these other three fingers uh, to um, play uh, a bunch of different styles and a bunch of different techniques. A lot of fun. Uh, everything from, I'll just run through a few a quick, uh, through a few quick examples. Uh, this would be like a chordal approach. Uh, so I'm using the pick to hit the bass note and then my middle ring and little finger to strike these things. So instead of a strumming effect, um, you're getting more of a kind of a piano where all the notes are hitting at one at one time, which is pretty cool. Um, a more standard kind of uh, when, when people think of hybrid uh, picking, maybe more standard example would be kind of a country approach where. Um, but I use this in all styles. And so uh, growing up, you know, I used to um, watch a lot of uh, Danny Gatton videos and stuff like that and, and footage of him playing and just really dug the fact that he would use this approach in jazz, country, rock, blues, funk, everything. Um, and so, like watch, for example, if I'm playing a blues in E and I do this little run, that kind of thing, right? These little, little harmonies. Well, if I apply the hybrid technique to that, uh, it's just the attitude change uh, makes it sound more like country, right? This, that, that, that attack versus like, you know, it, it automatically starts sounding a little bit more like country. So um, some exercises for this would be doing just that. Instead of playing this with a pick, try going. And you can see my right hand is pretty efficient. It's not doing anything crazy, not flying out here or anything. It's staying pretty controlled right up there, nice and tight because... As you play faster, this is going to be really efficient for your right hand to kind of keep that under control. Um, another great thing for, um, uh, you know, all styles but more versed in country is the, uh, the double stops, where I might take the A shape of the E, you know, combined with the G shape. So you get this, you know. Uh, I'm using my um, ring finger and middle finger to get those two notes. So that's hard to do with the pick, right? It, it's a different, um, a totally different attack. You get that nice pop. Now, if I go all the way to the back pickup, then I'm really getting into kind of the country territory. So um, if I'm in open E, uh, like the, the, oh, the, the big cowboy chord E down here, first position, I can start doing all these kind of like um, rolling pull-off hammer-on licks like this. Hard to do that slow. Let me try. Here's an example. Right, that's a total hybrid uh, picking thing where I'm going uh, the... Uh, Ascending lick is with the pick and the middle finger. And then I didn't use my ring finger until I hit that high E string. So that's... And a lot of these are like rolls. They're like banjo rolls, right? Right, that's like a little banjo roll in D. So I'm using that all the time. And so the best way to do this, I know this sounds crazy, but the best way to get into hybrid picking and using these other fingers is to just jump in and start doing it. Try these little, um, you know, even something like this. Watch if I'm playing the blues.
right? That kind of stuff. Go to the four. There's a good example of like um, non-country hybrid picking where you're just using uh, some blues ideas, you know, these little multiple string. Um, and so what I'm doing there is I'm using the pick to keep the bass note going. But I'm not doing any kind of crazy independence, like any kind of thumb alternating thumb bass or anything that has to like um, the bass has to keep going while you're doing these melodies and stuff like this. I'm just pinching, uh, basically pinching these together. Uh, kind of randomly, but you're hearing the effect of keeping that bass note going, which is pretty cool. So experiment with some of that. Um, this could go on and on and on forever, but there's a few little ideas that might help you um, right there. So enjoy. <laughs> 